talk. I play games to relieve stress. I have 1,240 followers. I have roughly 700 plus friends. I rant after quizzes on Twitter. I write news online. During the 48th World Communications Day, Pope Francis emphasized the revolution that is taking place in communications media and information technology. He said that though it is a great and thrilling challenge, may we to that challenge with fresh energy and imagination seek to share with others the beauty of God. Pope Benedict XVI also mentioned the same thing, saying, To do so requires us to approach social media as a powerful means of evangelization, to consider the Church's role in providing a Christian perspective on digital literacy. Social media can be a powerful tool for strengthening communities. Although social media interaction should not be viewed as a substitute for face-to-face -face gatherings, social media can support communities in a myriad of ways, connecting people with similar interests, sharing information about in-person events, providing ways for people to engage in dialogue, etc. As we all know naman, we're in the technological era, tapos so, super upgraded na lahat ng bagay, parang everyone can access sa social media sites na napakadali through smartphones. Kaya super laking impact niya, parang one, one click may change your life, parang ganon. It may make or break your life. I'm Sandrino Mangunay. There was a time na nung high school ako, when I looked at the mirror, I asked God, Lord, but but po ang guapo ko? Kasi nahihirapan ako. Ang daming nagkakagusto sa akin. As in, every time, kahit saan ako pumunta, ang dami pa sa ang daming nagkakagusto sa akin. Tapos, parang sobrang depressed na ako nun. That was the lowest part of my life talaga na sobrang down ako. Na The church encourages its members that it is their right to exercise their minimum level of participation in the economic, political, and cultural life of the society through social media, enabling the church to bring warmth and steer the hearts of every user. I was as an avenue para to relax, to get academic life. And usually na ano ko na dilibang ako syempre sa post ng iba ng ganyan syempre nag purpose ko rin sa pag-online yung para ma-update sa mga announcement ng ganyan kasi usually ginagawang tool yung social media sa pag-reach out sa students sa tulad ko mas napapadali yung ano communication ng mga kaibigan ko kunyari long distance kasi nung high school Di na kami magkakasama ngayong college eh. So, iwaiwalay na kami. So, at least, nakapag-communicate pa rin kami sa isa't isa, maski malayo. Being socially aware po ako sa mga happenings sa, hindi lang po dito, hindi lang po dito sa Pilipinas, kundi lang, kundi kasama rin po yung, ano, yung worldwide. And, mas nakoconnect po ako dun sa mga relatives ko na nasa ibang bansa. Kasi po, marami po akong relatives na nagkatrabaho na OFW po. The Second Vatican Council says that although we must be careful to distinguish earthly progress clearly from the increase of the Kingdom of Christ, such progress is still a vital concern to the Kingdom of God. Media as social communication can be seen to contribute greatly to the enlargement and enrichment of man's minds and to the propagation and consolidation of God's Kingdom. Yung social media ng versatorian, uh Ginawa siya talaga mainly para i-connect yung students and yung publication namin ng uh, 
mas madali. Uh, lalo na ngayon na nag-iiba yung panahon na kailangan uh, mas mabilis yung informasyon. Uh, ang bali ang ginawa ng Diversitaria, nag-step up siya para maka-adapt sa changing times. So yung isa sa mga improvements ng social media, uh, nagkaroon tayo ng comment section, lalo na sa website ng Barsi. Uh, gamit yung comment section, nakikita ng uh, publication namin kung uh, ano ba yung nagiging perception ng uh, students, uh, not only students, but also uh, professors as well, uh, tungkol sa nilalabas namin ng articles. For example, uh, nagkaroon kami ng, if ever, nagkaroon kami ng eratum, uh, ang ginagawa namin, uh, we do our best para mapalitan agad yun, para Siyempre, as journalists, uh, ang aim namin talaga ma-report, uh, mag-report accurately and truthfully. So, if there are times na hindi namin nagagawa yun o napupulfill namin, hindi namin napupulfill yun, uh, ginagawa namin na ganyan yung best namin para makorek yun. So, isa yun sa mga advantages ng social media, uh, mabilis yung pag-aayos ng pagkakamali, lalo na pagdating sa journalism. It was the picture that launched over a million likes, generated over a million dollars, and spawned an incredible movement. It turns out that picture started an amazing journey for this young man and his school. Blogger photographer Brandon Stanton, who was behind one of the internet's most popular photo websites, Humans of New York, stopped 13 year old Vidal for a photo and asked a simple question Who's influenced you most in your life? Pag may nakita akong mga quotes or mga pictures about Bible verses or about kay God, uh, sinishare ko to sa Facebook or sa Twitter kasi alam ko na maraming tao nangangailangan ng words si God. So, by this, pag-share ko sa mga pag-share ko, I know na maraming tao ma ang maabot nito. Uh, ginagawa ko to, for example, kasi alam ko na lahat ng tao may problema. So, Inisip ko na baka makatulong ito mga share-share ko sa kanila na malamin nila na kahit anong mangyayari, hindi sigat sa tabi nila. Many communication experts are describing the adaptation of social media as a paradigm shift in how humans communicate. A development as important as that of the printing press and the innovation of electronic communication. As a collective of online communications channels dedicated to a community-based input, interaction, content sharing, and collaboration, social media is becoming an integral part of life online as social websites and applications proliferate. It allows easy access to communication, knowledge, networks, and engagements at rapid speed, but at the same time, it can endanger face-to-face -face communication, distract, promote shallowness and an agent of bullying. Despite of all the pros and cons, let us all remember that communication started with the Trinitarian communication that reached out to humankind. Communication found its starting point in the communion of love. <laughs>